Uh, hello, everyone. I'm Yu Ting Zhang from the University of Michigan. I'm happy to present our paper, Discriminative Bimodal Network for Vision Organization and Detection with Natural Language Queries. This is a joint work with Wu Yao, Yi Jie, Zhi Yuan, Yi An, and my advisor, Hong Ai Kang Yi. Uh, we tackle the problem of detecting objects that match a text query, as shown in the figure, the objects of interest can be described in a flexible and comprehensive way. Previous work in this direction typically estimated the posterior of generating the query text given a bounding box and took it as a detection score. But the posterior is hard to fully model in the huge space of natural languages, making the detection score unreliable. As generative models, this method also used only positive text box pairs or at most a few negative samples during training. In contrast, we solve the detection problem in a fully discriminative way. By taking both the image region and the text phrase as the input condition and estimating the probability of their matching each other. The matching probability can be easily modeled with a binary classifier. Uh, which allows extensive use of all possible negative text box pairs during training. We call the model Discriminative Bimodal Network, or DBNet. Technically, we use a faster RCN baseline to extract the image features, and we use a character level CNN to extract the text features. And then a binary classifier for the image feature is generated dynamically based on the text feature. In the DBNet training, we consider any possible combination of boxes and text phrases. On the other hand, we also try to guarantee the correctness of the training labels as much as possible. To this end, we rule out text box pairs with potential uncertain labels based on the spatial overlapping with ground truth boxes and based on the text similarity between phrases. We performed our evaluation on the visual genome dataset for localizing a known to be existing object on a single image. DBNet outperformed previous methods significantly, as you can see in the table. For detecting non predefined number of objects on multiple images with text queries, we didn't find any existing result in previous work. So we proposed a benchmarking protocol. This protocol includes three difficulty levels and uses two types of average precisions for evaluating algorithm performance. The mean average precision takes each text phrase as a category and allows each category to have its own decision threshold. In contrast, the global average precision uh, uses the same decision threshold for any phrase. So in this scenario, we can perform zero-shot detection for new phrases without worrying about the decision threshold. The superior performance of DBNet demonstrates the importance of discriminative modeling and training. The significant performance difference in global average precision also indicates that the detection scores of DBNet are more calibrated over different text phrases. If you are interested in this work, please check out our poster and visit our webpage. Uh, thank you very much for your attention.